study by the experts as they think it is that of a giant of prehistoric time. This is one of the clues that kind of links with the legends that giants did exist. So this could be the same giants who are memorialized in these particular statues. Being home. See, I should have posed the question at the beginning, but do you think giants existed? We're still on the search, on the hunt for clues, history, any type of things to point to that they once roamed. Now we do have some things, but we need more evidence. Home to unknown critters and concealing millennia old relics, the solitude caves have a lot to offer. Leviathan beings residing in darkness or otherworldly figures hiding secrets. Let's find out what happened after a giant appeared in a Mexican cave and shocked the whole world. Dragon. This guy was exploring a cave and found a strange blob lying on the ground and the skeletal remains of some strange creature. He poked it with his foot, but couldn't determine what it was. Inspecting them resulted in just more questions as he didn't know who they belonged to. Unable to tell what he was seeing, he decided to back out. And just when he turned, he saw some giant horned beast in front of him. It disappeared as soon as it was seen. The man sacred to the bone ran out of the cave and believed he probably witnessed a dragon who had found refuge in that cave, but couldn't confirm as the sighting was very short-lived. Cave Skinwalker? A couple on a trip decided to explore a dark cave among the rocky hills. Moving ahead, they found it was an abandoned mine shaft with rails running down the path and sealed with metal panels. Out of curiosity, they ventured in hoping to find something. I don't, I don't hear it anymore. With curiosity has gotten a lot of people in trouble. I mean, that's all I want to say, curiosity, bro, because a lot of us is looking at them going, why are you doing that? Why are you doing that? Why are you going in there? Hmm? Curiosity killed that cat. That cat, we don't know the name of that cat, but it killed the cat. Absolutely nothing in sight, they felt relieved. But it was short-lived, as they suddenly noticed a pair of eyes glowing in the dark cave. Did you see that? It happened pretty fast, so let's see again. They quickly came out and left the place as they didn't want to become a part of the past. Who those eyes belonged to is still unclear, but the guy claimed it was a skinwalker. Cave worm. An adventure trip of two young guys took a strange turn when they found a cave. They went in and explored it through the tight space just to meet the slithery cave owner. Okay, uh, Owen. Owen. They found a huge limbless and wingless dragon-like creature that has been mentioned numerous times in ancient folklore as worm. These cave dwellers have never been spotted in real life. So this clip got a lot of attention on the internet where many people were shocked to see the mythical creature live. Some folks didn't believe it and thought it was nothing more than a computer-generated visual. But let me know what you think of this creature in the comments. Tunnel Monster A group of friends decided to trek down some ancient tunnels and unintentionally encountered a strange figure that emerged out of the dark background. It was not visible due to the darkness, but in the brightened video, you could see a small bipedal running right in front of them. Strangely, when those guys tried to chase it, it suddenly vanished into thin air. This bizarre encounter raised questions as to who the critter was and what the purpose of those eerie tunnels. Unearthed Mummy Scientists in Lima, Peru, unearthed a remarkable discovery. An old mummy was found. It was buried in a stone tomb, probably as a last minute thing while they were building a temple. The mummy was likely from a group called the Manche culture that existed in the Lima valleys a long time ago. These guys were into building temples shaped like a U always facing the rising sun. This discovery was like a time traveler from the past, giving us a peek into ancient Peruvian culture. Oh, 
Cyclops statue. What the? Out on an exploration trip to See, the now, seeing stuff like that makes me think that stuff like that once existed. Because if you think of back to when they could have created this, where were they drawing the inspiration from? See, that's what makes me hold on to the fact that it's possible that something like this could have existed. Cyclops Cave, located in Wales, this guy found Cape Greco's great secrets. Inside the cave were a lot of statues of strange shapes, but one of them stood out the most due to its unusual features. The sculpture had a single eye on its head that seemed out of place. Other relics found in the cave dated back to 6000 to 5500 BC. And let me tell you, that's very old. And that leads us to the big question as to what would have inspired this Cyclops figure so early in time. Thank you. Stone handprints. And this is a common sight in parts of the desert where you have vertical terrain, like in the honeycombs. And, uh... Amidst the red desert of the White Mountain in Wyoming, USA, lies something remarkable. In one of the White Stone Mountains, giant handprints are embedded. They are famous for being hand-carved by the indigenous people of the region. The residents of the region believe that the mountain is around 200 to 1,000 years old. But how these were carved is the true mystery. One of the theories says that they were embedded in the then soft mud, which hardened with time. These rock carvings are considered one of the most significant ones, which gather a lot of visitors daily. Cliff's so that means it doesn't necessarily have to be a hand, because I keep looking at that as it's a hand. It could have actually been a foot or something. You know what I mean? So we don't necessarily think it might be a, have to think it was a human or a giant human or whatever. It could have been a giant animal, and that was its foot, it was its paw, whatever you want to classify and call it. Yeah. A guy named Babu embarked on a journey to climb a hill in Kerala, India, along with his friends when he accidentally slipped and trapped on a steep canyon. After various failed rescue attempts, his friends sought help from villagers and local authorities. Unfortunately, all rescue operations failed due to his unsteady position and the harsh environmental conditions. The guy spent two days stuck in there until the chief minister intervened, seeking the assistance of the army. Eventually, Indian army officers crawled for hours to reach Babu and provided him with water before safely helping him to the hilltop. The unconventional nature of this guy's rescue reminded many people of the movie 127 Hours. However, unlike the film, Babu was rescued by the Indian army in the end. Weapon Cache אותו לא נתגלה בארץ ישראל מעולם, ארבע חרבות שהשתמרו בצורה מד... A very sensational discovery took place in the Judean desert, Israel. When excavators found not one but four swords, dating back to around 1,900 years old, preserved in excellent condition. These swords, along with a shafted weapon, were discovered in a cave crevice in the Engedi Nature Reserve, and they were probably hidden by the Judean rebels during the Jewish, Roman Wars. The 60 to 65 centimeters blades had well-fashioned handles made of wood or metal. The stash was transferred to the Israel Antiquities Authority Climate Controlled Laboratories for preservation and conservation. The discovery encouraged the researchers to find more of such artifacts. Egyptian mummy. Things can weigh up to a ton, but underneath we can already see clearly. Egyptian archaeologists embarked on a remarkable journey near Cairo when they unearthed the astonishing remains, 2,500 year old mummy that was believed to be of a high priest. The excavators showed the hidden tombs and chambers where these antique treasures were found. Alongside the mummy, various mysterious artifacts, including an early Egyptian board game, the remains of a dog, a wax head, and four jars used to store a mummy's organs were also found. The discovery sheds light on ancient Egyptian burial practices and provides valuable insights into the history and culture of the region. Oh my word! So I'm guessing they were trying to preserve the organs to go with them to the, to the afterlife or, or death and beyond or whatever they classified it as. I'm guessing that's the only thing I can think about. Why, why would they put the organs in this case enclosed and then sit it inside the tomb? 
It's interesting. I've never heard I've never heard them speak about that. I've heard them talk about jewels. I've heard them talk about animals. I've heard them talk about, you know, different things they put in there. Never organs. That's a first. Look at this! Cave Creeper. Exploration of the unknown places can unveil all kinds of stuff. Sometimes ordinary things can seem very unique, like these explorers who ventured into a cave and couldn't help but wonder what creatures might be lurking in the darkness. Suddenly, they spotted a pair of glowing eyes staring back at them. Fearfully, they wondered whether it was a wolf, mountain lion, or bear. Even with their curiosity brewing, they decided not to investigate further. Instead, they wisely turned back, with footage of the eerie sight in hand. It's really important to know when to back out. <laughs> Pale Resident. Yes. Embarking on a European adventure, this tourist looked forward to exploring an ancient cave perched about 10,000 feet above sea level in Hallstatt, Austria. Amidst the breathtaking scenery of glaciers and rock formations, the tourist's excitement turned to astonishment when he spotted a strange pale figure crawling on the cave's ceiling. You might think it's just a lizard, but it seemed to resemble a tiny humanoid figure. The mysterious sight left a bunch of questions, and the clip ignited speculations among viewers, where some thought it was either a cryptid or a new species, while others said that it was a cave spirit lurking in the freezing cave. Alien in Cave Imagine a creature with a huge skull that had long bony arms, and it seemed like it was going after the people recording it. This spine-chilling sight was captured in Sagada, Philippines a few years back, and with a very puzzling mystery. No one knows who recorded it, or when. It's unclear if this creature was protecting the cave, or something that we just can't figure out. It's very, very old. Since it came out, people avoid the cave where it happened. That strange creature really makes you question what's real, doesn't it? I don't blame people for avoiding that cave after seeing that. I would do the same thing. What do you mean? Giant's den. Back in 2016, a very strange video surfaced from Giant's Causeway UK that opened up a series of investigations. A visitor was exploring the natural reserve when he accidentally captured a giant wall of rocks open and closed, all on its own. Earlier today, we were being told tourists and National Trust rangers saw the legendary Finn disappear. Right, I believe we have some footage that has been taken on a mobile phone. Look, look. Speculation arose that it was probably a giant figure disappearing into the rocks. Some even suggested that the giant might be entering hibernation for winter. It led to an investigation where every stone on the wall was checked, but no reliable proof was found. It wasn't confirmed whether a giant could be living there or not, but the incident sure caused a surge of visitors to the location. Peru the reason why I say I don't think it's real, number one, I mean, the optics, look at the way it looked. It looked like it was, I don't know, maybe a scene for a movie or something like that. The second thing is, they would have tore that mountain to pieces. They, those rocks, oh man, they'd have dug all in that mountain trying to get to that thing. So that's, that's what's making me continue to believe that that's some kind of hopes or, and not really believe the footage because they're not going to let no rock stand in their way of getting into what they think could be in that mountain. Two giants. A family on an exploration trip in Peru came across something that they couldn't decipher. Two giant humanoid figures were found standing on the top of a mountain, and they weren't normal humans, but tall, looming giants. Here have a look at the comparison between humans on top of the mountain and these entities side by side. The height difference is evident, even from a large distance. A lot of people speculated that they might be some extraterrestrial visitors, but due to the video's low quality, nothing could be said for sure. Slender Giant. Posted a few months back, this video has intrigued many people on the internet. Filmed at an unknown location, a giant yet thin figure with extremely long legs was found, doing push-ups. The clip has left the viewers wondering about its identity. Some people said it was a Slender Man showing off his gym routine, while others speculated it might be something related to a Bigfoot as they prefer living in secluded places. Yeah, but it's good form too. Its true identity has remained a mystery. 
giant Nephilim. Recently, a video recorded from a mountain in Thailand claimed to have captured a giant human, causing a global sensation. The clip shows a figure standing on one of the peaks in the distance, yet the foggy environment in the video made it hard to decipher what it was. So many people jumped in to speculate, and these giant humanoid figures became the new trend as they have sparked curiosity among giant enthusiasts. But these weren't just tall tales. They were actually captured on camera and shared for all to see on the internet. In a world where the extraordinary is just a click away, the unknown behind these mountain giants has remained unsolved. Mexican Bigfoot. A very harrowing sight unfolded on a mountain in Mexico when a giant figure appeared behind a residential building terrifying the entire town. The incident caused chaos among the residents who came out of their houses screaming out of fear. Everyone thought that their town was being invaded. A few netizens suggested that it was the comeback of the ancient giants. As Mexico has been famous for alien conspiracies, people also entertained the possibility of some extraterrestrial entity. The figure remained inconclusive, as no one was able to put a name on it. But it sure gave the townsfolk a good scare. Utah Sasquatch in the rugged region of Utah, two deer hunters were on their way to Garden City when they came across a curious sight, a dark giant figure moving across the Golden Land. Concerned for safety in an active hunting area, they quickly filmed the scene and continued their journey. Days later, while reviewing the footage, they were shocked to realize the figure was no ordinary person. It was much larger, towering over any human they'd seen, maybe a Sasquatch. And it wouldn't be a wild assumption, as Utah has a history of sightings of these giants. Here's another incident on hills near Provo, Utah, where a group of friends stumbled upon a towering figure that seemed right out of a legend. Seriously, look how big it is. I don't think it is a human. I think it's a Sasquatch. The giant was strolling. It's just weird that it's just out in the open. Just out in the open, just like it's just enjoying the day going for a walk through the snowy ground. With cameras in hand, they decided to search the entity, but the mystery persisted as nothing was found. So I'm seeing something that is not deer tracks anymore. We're trying to determine what it, what, what it is. Experts doubted the existence of such creatures, but the curiosity of the unknown still draws people back to the wilderness. A Bigfoot in action. With their cameras rolling, they captured the creature's unmistakable presence while it was knocking wood and its echoes sounded through the wilderness. But that's not the end of it, as they discovered there was more than just one creature lurking in the shadows. Among the trees, they found signs of the creature such as stinky Bigfoot hair and massive footprints. With this trail of evidence, they would probably be able to solve the mystery once and for all. Look where my thumb's pointing. See him? Cougar release. If you can, uh, if we, actually, if we can get one hind foot, the scary part is once it's out. The Division of Wildlife Resources in Pine Valley Mountains, Utah, received a call about a giant cougar found stuck in a bobcat trap. The rescue team responded and arrived immediately to assist in releasing the animal. They put a ring on its neck and covered its eyes to calm it down. In no time, the mountain lion was free to run wild again. Now you must be thinking, how did the wild cat get trapped? Well, that's because trapping in Utah is considered crucial for controlling predator populations and wildlife management. Saltwater Crocodile This clip posted on social media left people scratching their heads when an alleged 50-foot long saltwater crocodile fossil was discovered in Cape Jervis, Australia. Instead of appreciating the discovery, People speculated its authenticity. Many didn't even believe it, saying that the fossils were really old remnants, not full-blown animals lying around. Some people also said that it was probably a statue carved out of a rock, as the slits in its eyes were pretty visible, while that wouldn't be the case if it was a fossil. You know, that's a croc. That's, that was actually, you could tell, you could see, you could see where the eyes was, you could see where the teeth was. I don't think that was a, something carved out of a rock. But these delusional people are the same people who are delusional about a uh, saltwater croc being in the ocean or coming up to the beach. Like, literally, again, stay out of the water. 
Utah Giant. In this recent footage from Salt Lake City, Utah, a very strange sight unfolded near a bustling rock quarry. A mysterious silhouette was captured against the evening clouds that resembled a massive being perched on the mountainside. The onlookers were struck by the uncanny image. I oh know, that thing's kind of creepy. It's like a person's silhouette up in the clouds. Numerous speculations arose about the figure's origins, with some suggesting it might be linked to quarry activities, while some also said that it was probably a giant humanoid living on the mountain. But with countless such sightings, this one was also not confirmed, and viewers have left with more questions than answers. I'm sorry, if it was your mountain, I'm sorry I broke it. Spider. This guy exploring a deep cave in Laos stumbled upon an extraordinary sight. A spider the size of a large pizza was clinging to the stone wall. Its eyes reflected light like a cat's, which made it all the more spectacle. As he was observing the giant arthropod, it just disappeared with lightning speed, vanishing into the darkness, leaving the visitor in awe. From the appearance, it looked like a giant huntsman spider. Known for its size, distinct eye reflection, and swift movement aligned with this description, but its sudden disappearance was truly unexpected. Yeah, I don't care what type of spider, huntsman, fisherman, whatever type of spider it wanna be, they're all bad. And that's why I'm going to, bro, can you imagine inside of a cave and something just drop on you? Coming up out of that cave, bro. Cockroach cave. Cockroach. Welcome to Gomantong Cave on Borneo Island which millions of bats and cockroaches call home. This 300 foot tall cavern is split into two main chambers, the black cave and the white cave. This creepy sight of countless bats and swiftlet birds and the food droppings from these creatures attracting hordes of cockroaches gave the cave its nickname, the Cockroach Cave. Even with all the creepy crawly presence, Gomantong Cave has become a tourist destination. If you're brave enough to venture in, just be sure to wear closed toe shoes and some gloves to avoid these creepers crawling up your leg. Giant footprints. Oh, wow. uh. This guy on a trip to Adams Peak in Sri Lanka came across a very remarkable sight. A very strange rock with a gigantic human footprint, complete with toes and a heel. The footprint appeared pretty embedded in the rock. The now that definitely looks like a foot. Before we was looking at something, you couldn't tell if it was a hand or a foot. That definitely looks like you see the big toe. People believed that it was the footprint of Adam, hence the name. And the presence of coins left behind by visitors tells the cultural significance of the site. Here are some more giant footprints from around the world. And this one's even more huge than the last ones. So could there be a giant human foot imprint? Real or not, these places have become the ultimate proof of giant humans that probably existed in the very distant past, which hundreds of people visit each day. Giant spotted. It's a person, dude. Humanoid giants, extremely elusive, living all the way up on a mountain, has been the talk of the town. Have a look at what these guys filmed on their road trip. While recording the snow-covered mountains, their camera caught a strange figure on top of the mountain. Again in Mexico, a giant human. The guys argued about if it was a human or something else. Labeled as the giant human sighting, the clip garnered a lot of attention on the internet. I think anytime someone sees something from a distance that they can't pinpoint right away, becomes the next giant human sighting. But even with all the blurry clips and foggy visuals, people still go crazy about them. There's a person standing there. No, it's not. Dude, have you seen what I've seen right now? Oldest footprints. <laughs> In 2018, researchers in British Columbia stumbled upon something extraordinary. Human footprints dating back 13,000 years. They painted a picture of ancient life, where humans shared space with wild animals. But just a few years later, in 2021, a discovery in New Mexico's White Sands National Park changed everything. When another set of footprints, dating between 21,000 and 23,000 years old, challenged what experts thought they knew about early human settlement in North America. These findings suggest humans might have arrived in the southwestern US much earlier than believed. The discovery shook up our understanding of history and raised new questions about our ancient past. 800 years old treasure. This group of friends was out on an exploration deep within an enormous mountain range when they unintentionally made an exceptional discovery. 
Finding ruins with the help of Google Earth, they started digging and found this, an 800-year-old treasure locked in sealed clay pots. They cautiously opened it and found a load of accessories from ancient times, probably history of a civilization that mastered handicrafts and blacksmithing. The clip got a lot of attention on the internet. Many people thought that the entire thing was staged and was unlikely for ancient civilizations to have such jewelry. But I'd like- If it ain't staged, they're rich. Bro pulled out a crown, looks like a crown. No, yeah, yeah, that's going for some money. I'd like to hear your thoughts on this discovery. Let me know in the comments. Anti-witch marks. Inside the caverns of Creswell Crags, amidst prehistoric artwork, lies a fascinating discovery. Well, here we've got a chamber which is absolutely covered in witch mark. The ceiling and all the walls. Initially thought to be graffiti, it was only recently revealed that there are hundreds of anti-witch marks etched into the walls. These eerie symbols, carved by trembling hands, were meant to ward off evil spirits and witches, showing the lengths of ancient superstition. The medieval markings consisted of the Latin initials of Jesus and depictions of the Virgin Mary. And they're a reminder that even in the darkest of times, humanity has always found ways to confront and conquer its fears. Crab Fossil. A YouTuber in New Zealand made an amazing discovery after finding a giant rock. He carefully removed the rock around the fossil in a time-lapse video. It took him a whopping 208 hours to get the fossil ready for its big reveal. Inside the rock was a super old crab fossil, about 12 million years old and turned out to be a Tumido Carcinus giganteus that lived during the mid-Miocene era. The crab was a pretty hefty one, weighing about 7.3 kilograms. He chipped away at over 16 kilograms of rock to set it free. It the crabs of today will never get that size. No, we eat them too much. <laughs> I mean, we don't give them time to get that size. You see how big that joker is, man? It's crazy to see how we go to great lengths to find just a peak from the past. Three-Headed Arrow In the Norwegian wilderness, a treasure hunter stumbled upon a Viking-era treasure. A three-sided arrowhead of triangular shape and razor-shopped edges. That left historians scratching their heads about its purpose. Many suggested that it was made to hunt animals or other dangerous creatures. Archaeologists were amazed by the craftsmanship of the arrow and were intrigued if they knew geometry or just enjoyed making new weapons. Even though the purpose of the arrow remained a mystery, it sure provided an opportunity to understand the Viking lifestyle a bit better. Giant Snowman A couple of years back, visitors of the snowy Pyrenees Mountains of Spain witnessed a very terrifying sight. High in the mountains was the legendary abominable snowman. That could be a bear. That, that could be a bear. Man. And the guy captured the sight on camera for the world to see. The short and shaky footage sparked excitement among believers and skeptics alike. The mysterious creature turned its head, leaving viewers intrigued. Despite efforts by authorities at the nearby ski resort to investigate, no concrete evidence was found. Many even questioned the authenticity of the footage. The mystery behind the creature left everyone curious. Prehistoric Crocodile An exploration team was out on their hunt for the next big thing in Tunisia when they discovered something straight out of nature's wild vault, a giant prehistoric crocodile. While digging around in an unexplored area, crew members noticed bone protruding from the ground, which led to the excavation of a massive crocodile skeleton. The crocodile was named Mokimo Soros, estimated to be over five feet long and believed to be a previously unknown species. Mokimo Soros was found related to a group of large marine crocodiles that faced extinction, providing insights into the region's ancient ecosystem. Stuck Dogs A guy enjoying the scenic landscapes of the desert Arizona when he found something truly strange, two dogs in a nook on the mountain. They had their tags on and were probably stuck there after being abandoned by their owner. Ignoring the risks of the dangerous hills, he decided to help the poor pups from up there. He fixed himself with a rope and was ready to embark on his rescue mission, climbing the steep hill. He caught the little ones and took them down. After a visit to the vet, the dogs found new homes, and the guy's vacation turned into a heartwarming adventure of saving lives in the desert. No, did they find the owner? That's the person they need to find. He need to see jail time for that, bro. I don't like that. 
I don't like them dogs didn't deserve that, man. No way. <laughs> like, fam, I'm telling y'all, man, ever since I've become a dog owner, I get it. I might not have got it before, but I get it now, and that's cruel. Unforeseen encounter. Exploring the caves can be very adventurous. It's always a thrill not knowing what you'd find out. Like this guy who entered a cave and was not prepared when he found a lion, resting in a tight nook inside the cave. Luminescent eyes ready to pounce even in a comfortable pose. It growled at the man. And he was probably in luck as he got out of there before getting under the predator's paws. <laughs> Giant statues. <laughs> Till now we have y'all be lucky. Some of y'all be get lucky, man. Seen all kinds of stuff emerging from caves and ancient stone carvings. Now let's have a look at these amazing giant statues carved into mountains. This Leshan Buddha statue on Mount Emei in southwest China was carved back in the eighth century. The sculpture was completed in 803 A.D and is still a great tourist attraction even after 1200 years. There's another awe-inspiring collection of Buddhist sculptures known as Dazu rock carvings in the Chongqing municipality of southwestern China. The carvings provide great insights into ancient Chinese culture and beliefs. This massive sculpture carved into Mount Rushmore in the Black Hills region of South Dakota features the past US presidents, George Washington, Thomas Jefferson, Theodore Roosevelt, and Abraham Lincoln. And something is interesting about this sculpture, a secret room behind Abraham Lincoln's hairline. It contains all the details of the work done on the mountain and the society that created it. Devil's Doorway. Near Lake Titicaca, Peru, settled in the rugged terrain, lies a fascinating anomaly, the Devil's Doorway, also known as Amaru Muru. Carved into towering red sandstone, this mysterious portal defies explanation. Conspiracy has it that visitors are drawn by its strange energy, said to originate from the channels covering the sides of the doorway. Even with its enigmatic origins, it has been a site of pilgrimage for centuries, calling travelers to experience its ancient power. Labeled as the Devil's Doorway by the Catholic Church, its popularity remains the same. Abandoned Building Recently, a very strange discovery was made in the mountains of Giju, China. Recorded during a drone exploration of the region, a mysterious building was found nestled in between the hills. The purpose of the building has remained unknown. No one knows who built it and how the materials for the construction were transported to the exclusive location. With no exploration done in the area, as its route seems to have no reach, the building is still a puzzle. Now it's time for today's open discussion. This picture going viral on the internet was captured when people in Mexico claimed that they have witnessed a giant living in a cave on the mountain. The video was posted on TikTok and featured a strange humanoid figure sitting near the opening of the cave. Speculations about its identity started with many believing that it was a giant taking shelter in the cave, but a lot of people also dismissed it as a hoax due to poor video quality. By the way, why are all these sightings so blurry and incomprehensible? With no reliable information, this sighting was also left open-ended. But if these giants do exist, I think they should be left alone to live in peace.